Hello friends, how are you all, I hope you are all well. Ever since Ant and Deck hit their Britain's Got Talent Series 16 golden buzzer for professional beatboxer MB14, fans have been quick to criticize the hosts for their pick. Many are upset because the beatboxer is already pretty famous in the United Kingdom. Last Saturday, Mohamed Belker, also known as MB14, took the Britain's Got Talent stage for the first time. He performed a funky beatbox routine that left judges and audience questioning how he did it. MB14 managed to make his voice sound like a violin, opera singer, percussion, and even more. Even though his audition was outstanding, fans didn't necessarily agree with the golden buzzer. Soon after MB14's audition ended, hosts Ant and Deck decided to rush on stage to give their golden buzzer. Throughout the performance, the two looked intrigued by the act, so it was no surprise they rushed the stage. MB14 is a former The Voice star, Barry Wom member. Although the judges didn't ask much about his experience, MB14 has a ton on his resume. He primarily rose to fame from his appearance on The Voice France in 2016, where he placed in second and was granted a record deal. He was such a big name on this series that he appeared on The Voice France All Stars 2021. Hello, everyone, welcome to my channel. Please subscribe and keep watching for more details. BGT fans criticize Ant and Dex Golden Buzzer professional beatboxer MB14. Corey Cesare. May 12, 2023. MB14 poses with Ant and Deck after BGT Golden Buzzer. Britain's Got Talent. Ever since Ant and Deck hit their Britain's Got Talent series 16 Golden Buzzer for professional beatboxer MB14, fans have been quick to criticize the hosts for their pick. Many are upset because the beatboxer is already pretty famous in the United Kingdom. Last Saturday, Mohamed Belkir, also known as MB14, took the Britain's Got Talent stage for the first time. He performed a funky beatbox routine that left judges and audience questioning how he did it. MB14 managed to make his voice sound like a violin, opera singer, percussion, and even more. Even though his audition was outstanding, fans didn't necessarily agree with the golden buzzer. Sponsored links you may like. Shop till you drop with incredible discounts and deals. Geomart. By Tabula. Soon after MB14's audition ended, hosts Ant and Deck decided to rush on stage to give their golden buzzer. Throughout the performance, the two looked intrigued by the act, so it was no surprise they rushed the stage. MB14 is a former The Voice star, Barry Wom member. Although the judges didn't ask much about his experience, MB14 has a ton on his resume. He primarily rose to fame from his appearance on The Voice France in 2016, where he placed in second and was granted a record deal. He was such a big name on this series that he appeared on The Voice France All Stars 2021. Ahead of The Voice France All Stars, MB14 was a part of the famous French beatboxing group, Barry Wom. Reportedly, MB14 joined Barry Wom in 2015. The group then announced his departure in April 2019. Interestingly enough, his departure came two months before Barry Wom's AGT audition aired. While MB14 was a part of Barry Wom, they took place in the French beatbox battle 2015 and 2016, finishing in second and first respectively. In 2018, the group became the champion of the fifth international beatbox battle. MB14 left Barry Wom to pursue his solo career, and he has a ton of titles to show for it. In 2017 he won third place in the loop station category The Grand Beatbox Battle, a year later he won first place tag team at World Beatbox Camp, and in 2019 he won the same award once again. In modern day, MB14 recently made his debut in the film industry with 2022 film tenor, fans react to the golden buzzer. Immediately after this episode aired, BGT fans fled to Twitter to share their critics of the golden buzzer. Since BGT is notorious for its underdog story format, many were upset to find out that MB14 is successful, while some just took to Twitter share his big-time accomplishments, others aired out how they really felt, surprisingly, no one mentioned MB14's past in Barrywam. 
This is honestly probably due to the fact that he quit the group before they appeared on AGT. Ironically though, MB14's former group, Barawam recently appeared on America's Got Talent again, for the spin-off AGT All-Stars. Although it's too soon to tell, could fan criticism ruin MB14's chances to win BGT Series 16? Let us know what you think in the comments down below.